Okay, I want to show some examples of how to figure out if a function is an even function or if a function is an odd function. f of x is an even function if, when you figure out f of minus x, you get exactly what f of x was. If you do f of minus x and you get minus f of x, then the function is considered odd. If neither one of these situations happens, then you call it neither. So sometimes you get neither. All right, so let me show you what that happens. g of x is this function, x to the third minus x. I need to figure out what happens when I put a minus x in there. So let's try it. Minus x to the third minus a minus x. And then I'm just going to simplify the signs. Minus x to the third is minus x to the third. Minus a minus x ends up being plus x. Now, is this exactly what I started with? No. So the function is not even, okay? Not even. All right. Is it the opposite of what I started with. Well, what's the opposite of that? Minus x cubed minus x. And when I figure the opposite of that, I distribute the minus and I get minus x to the third plus x. Oh, hey, that's what I got. So if when I plug in minus x, if I get the same thing, I say it's even. If I get the opposite of what I plugged, of what I started with, then I say it's odd. So what is this function? It's an odd function. All right, let's try again for this other one. I'm going to put in a minus x, so I'm going to figure out h of minus x. When I do that, I put a minus x, square it, plus 1. Now I'm going to figure it out and I get x squared plus 1. All right, there's my answer. Now, first compare it to the original. Is it exactly like the original? Oh, it is. So if it's exactly like the original, it's even. So when you plug minus x, every place there's an x in the equation, and then simplify it, if you get exactly what you started with, it's an even function. If you get 100% the opposite by distributing a minus sign, then it's odd. Now, sometimes you get a mix-up that it looks almost like the original, but a little different. In that case, then you just say that it's neither. So, uh, good luck with these problems. There were a couple in the homework.